Everybody loves a controversy, especially when it is about celebrities. Did you guys hear about Kylie Jenner reacting to Zendaya copying her? Kylie and Zen, two very famous and inspiring ladies, have become a hot topic on the internet. What do you guys think happened? Is there a problem between them? Did Kylie stare at Tom or something? Hey, did you all hear about the wax statue of Zendaya? Is that the beginning of this topic? Want to know more about this? Well, you are in the right place. Stay with us till the end to find out. Hey guys, welcome back to Celebrity Loop. If you're here for the first time, support us by hitting the subscribe button and turning on post notifications to never miss out on what's going on with your favorite celebrities. On that note, let's continue. After her brilliant performance on Euphoria, Zendaya owned the headlines of all social media platforms, but now she is trending for a different reason. Yes, you guessed it right, I am talking about her wax figure in Madame Tussauds Wax Museum in London. If you feel like it is just a wax figure and what is so special about it, well, the figure's resemblance to Kylie Jenner has spiced things up. It does look like Zendaya, but not gonna lie, if someone comes and tells you that it is Kylie's wax structure, you may believe it. If you know Zendaya, you must know about her fan base on Twitter. If you are a Tom Dea shipper, you will know the number of tweets they got. Even on this issue, the Twitterati showed their despair that their idol's wax structure looks like Kylie Jenner. There were also a group of people who said that the wax structure looked like the late Naya Rivera. Twitter was loaded with tweets like, this looks like they had a Kylie Jenner figure already made, but then they decided to remodel it for Zendaya, but were too lazy to redo half the face, so they just left it. They do sound very offended. Another user posted, it's like the wax maker started making Zendaya, got confused, started making Kylie Jenner, remembered it was supposed to be Zendaya, said meh, and clocked the F out. Uh-huh, even though the user said it for fun, it does make sense. What if the structure was made by a hardcore Kylie fan and he or she had Kylie's face on their mind the whole time? Do you guys think this could be a possibility? Some people feel like the wax structure looks a lot like both Kylie and the late Naya Rivera and nothing like Zendaya. They posted tweets like, somebody needs to get a torch and melt this thing down to nothing and then make something that looks like Zendaya, not Kylie. In the end, people have different perceptions and there actually are people who do agree that the structure looks exactly like Zendaya. Out of all the talks out there, the best one people said is that the structure looks like a baby of Kylie and Zendaya and it grew and borrowed Zendaya's pink suit to model for the wax structure. Damn, now that's intense. How bad is this statue? What do you think the creators of the wax structure are going through? Want to know how they reacted to the criticism poking them through social media? They posted a picture of the wax structure with a caption, Our talented artists created our new Zendaya figure using measurements and references taken during her 2015 sitting. I think they are referring to Zendaya's iconic appearance at the 2016 Humane Society of the United States to the Rescue Gala, which included a head-to-toe hot pink pantsuit and a very sleek, very tight low bun and sparkly stud earrings. Does that mean Zendaya used to look like Kylie in 2015? I don't think so. It seems like even Tim Waters, general manager at Madame Tussauds London, is also a fan of Zendaya. It is evident from his words. He said, as Zendaya just exudes cool. Not only that, she uses her celebrity status to join conversations thoughtfully on important social issues. He also says to Pop Sugar that she is unapologetically herself, and we, along with her fans, love that about her. With rumors circulating that Zendaya is soon to become a Londoner herself, the timing to pay homage to her at Madame Tussauds London could not be better. We know her fans will be lining up for the chance to meet their idol when Zendaya's figure arrives in our awards party zone. Did he keep his word? To be honest, we agree that Tim could not show the respect and love he emitted in his words on the work that he did. If the wax structure was spot on, it would have been a great day for both the Euphoria superstar and her fans. Instead, the day was stolen by Kylie and her followers. Disappointed fans showed their disappointment with comments like, Zendaya has the most beautiful smile, so I think it would have been nicer if the figure captured that. She doesn't really pout like this. 
They also said that she has super pretty eyes. I'm not sure the figure has fully captured her natural beauty, but it's a good effort. It is very true, Zendaya has very lively eyes. The wax structure indeed was a disappointment. Do you think Zendaya has enemies in the industry? Does it feel like there is an invisible and that has interfered in the making of the structure? I mean, normally, the wax structures look better than the real person, but in Zendaya's case, the structure can't match the beauty she naturally has. It is sad, but a flex too, you know. Hey guys, but what if it is something about the photograph? What if it is different because of the lighting and the structure looks exactly like Zendaya when you see it in person? What do you think the museum authorities have to say about this? We understand that when fans are incredibly passionate, they might feel differently until they have had the chance to see it up close. The museum also said that they are getting loads of positive and encouraging comments too, but comments like, the thing she's doing with her lips is giving Kylie Jenner, the real Zendaya has never made that face in her life. This doesn't look like her at all, and I'm seriously confused about the outfit. She has rocked some seriously iconic looks, and this is what you went with? Why? Are hard to unsee and have put the museum in a tough spot. If you guys think that it is the first time Kylie is dealing with wax structures, well, she literally has a wax structure of her mom on her house. She showed it out to the world by saying, She's mine now. I don't want to get any texts or phone calls from my sisters after this. She's mine. If you watch the House of Wax movie, I am pretty sure you guys are very creeped out with this news. Imagine getting down at midnight for a drink and you see your mother's wax structure guarding the fridge. LOL, that is scary. It is so easy to criticize, but do you guys have any idea on how a wax structure is made? Do you have any idea how much it costs? Wax figures from Madame Tussauds typically cost almost $200,000 to make, already gassed out. Then how would you react when you know that it takes four months to construct? And it includes real human hair, which is individually inserted by artists with utmost care and perfection. Sounds like it is not as easy as we thought, yeah? Well, the critics on the internet do not have to know about the hardships that the museum owners have to go through. Kylie and her family are into wax structures, and did you know that every one of them has one on Madame Tussauds? Kris Jenner posts the picture of their wax structure on Twitter with a caption, How amazing is this? Our new wax figures at Madame Tussauds New York opening Tuesday. Me, Courtney, Kim, Kylie, Chloe, and Kendall will all have our wax figures together for the first time. All of their statues are exquisite and so well done that there is hardly any difference. What went wrong with Zendaya? Does the Jenners or the Kardashians have anything to do with this? Well, there are rumors that there is a very unethical presence of some very important people in the industry on the making of Zendaya's wax structure. Who are these people? What could be the reason? Is it because Zendaya is being praised to the skies for her performance in Euphoria? Or is it because she is having an off-screen romance with Spider-Man? People really got no chill. Zendaya looks stunning with any outfit, so let's keep that aside. But the pose? That pout actually makes us feel like she is pissed and wants to sue someone. For an actress like her and the beautiful expressions that have magically flown through her face, this was not a good selection. Fans are not very happy about this and they feel like their idol deserved so much better. Guys, it's Zendaya we're talking about. I really pray Tom Holland doesn't meet with the creators of the structure. If he did, I'm pretty sure that he'd use his Spider-Man web shooters to tie their hands. Well, the stunning actress has not yet commented on the incident and nor did Kylie Jenner. Maybe it is not an issue for them and they are cool about it. Fans are waiting for Zendaya's reaction, but I don't think that she will comment on this particular incident. Even though we still have no solid proof other than a few photographs, it is obvious that the wax structure does look like Kylie a lot. The wax structure looks like how Zendaya would look if she had plastic surgery like Kylie. Isn't that so sad? I mean to wait for so long with so much curiosity and hear bad news. Let's just hope that the wax structure is not as bad as people claim and looks so much better in person like the creators say. Well, that was a lot, and we have come to the end of today's video. If you haven't subscribed already, make sure to do that and hit the bell icon to never miss out on some of your favorite celebrities. If you're a Tom Dea fan, let us know that by hitting the like button. We'll meet all of you yet again with another juicy video. Until then, bye!